come back in my bathroom. Today I'm doing the video in English because uh, uh, the brand Titaner, which you can find at the website www.titaner.com, as you can see, as you can read here, uh, sent me this razor, which is actually very beautiful. It's the first razor made of Titan that I have. So I was bit, uh, really curious about the material and the reality is that once you have it in your hand, you feel it very premium. This razor has a peculiar design, uh, which we can see here from the head, which is very thin, for example, and allow you to, to refine your moustache or beard or whatever with very high precision, and I loved it. Uh, other than that, I like this area here, and I love also the shape of the handle, which is very simple, but very, very stylish. Uh, the fact that it has this two flat side, as you can see here, two flat sides, um, allow you to have a great grip, even if it's sleek, actually. It doesn't have anything uh, uh, to help you with, uh, with the grip, but you have a great grip. And then, last but not least, you have this bottom part, which is round, so once you put the razor, and this is very intelligent in my opinion, once you put the razor on the stand, like this, if there is water, this water drips along the handle, and then from, from these uh, shape, it goes down, and hands up here, where you have two holes to get rid of the water. This is very beautiful. Besides that, uh, the razor has a very nice locking system, and we will see it, we'll watch it right now uh, while I harm it. Uh, first of all, it takes out the blade. So I'm using a half Derby Premium. I'm sorry if I'm sweating, but here in Italy we have 35 degrees Celsius in the shade, so it's quite warm. Anyway, we have this little knob, which is, well, between the knob and the head itself, there is a rubber gasket that allow you to have no friction once you strengthen the, the knob, and then you just, oh, not yet, you just, here we go, you just pull up the head, which is magnetically held in place. Uh, so you have two retaining system, which is the magnetic one and the knob. The only one thing of this head that I noticed, and we will see it while I shave, because actually I did first the video in Italian, and now I'm doing the video in English, and I use it. I use the razor once more in the in the middle. So now I have a clear idea about this razor and its shape. The the head at the beginning might seem very vertical, which at the very beginning when when you use it. It like force you to, to hold it like this, but it's not true, actually, you can hold it like this. Uh, so at the beginning I had some problem going against the grain, because I had the handle that was hitting my chin, but no, it's not like that. Once you get used to, to the, um, the head itself, it doesn't go that way, and the reason is that the head is so light and so gentle, it's very gentle on your skin, very, very gentle on your skin. So it's so light and gentle that uh, you don't feel it. So to feel it more, you, are, you, you think that putting more vertical makes you feel it more, but you're actually not doing it properly. Anyway, let's go ahead and shave. Today's soap is the 
Ariana and Evans, Chan Mei, which I loved, is a, a great, great, great formula. Really, really. They did a great job with the formula. And the brush will be my beloved Omega Elite Golf version. Just took a shower and it's sweating again but yeah there is nothing you can do about that other than having air conditioning in your toilet which is something i don't have obviously Great, great, great thick moisturized light leather is what you get from this soap. I guess I can go. So the shape of the head is, I will show you, is prismatic basically. So being this way, it forces you a little bit in the angle of attack of the head. Now I have been speaking with the tightener and they say that in the next batch, uh, considering my, my suggestion, they will put the head a little bit more like this to make it easier, but honestly, it actually can go this way anyway. Of course, there are there are razors that give you that gives you a closer shave, closer than this one, but it's still a really close shave with a very 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 premium instrument. Now I don't know how much this razor cost and. I have to be honest about that, I don't know it, and the reason is that they sent it to me. But is 
very premium. I mean, once you hold it in your hand, it's like having a sculpture in your hand and you can see it and feel it. Anyway, tightener, produce quite a few stuff, not only razors, and that's interesting. They do stuff in titanium, so it might be interesting sometimes to go on the website Now, the, something that I really like about this razor is that it is light like aluminum, but the feeling in your hand is definitely more premium. Definitely. Look at this.
So another thing that I want to remark is that the ladder channel down here on this razor works really fine. No matter if you're going to cut area with a lot of air or... Uh, yeah, let's do it. I, I, will, I will shorten this. As you can see, it goes deep enough and it expels everything from down there. So you don't incur in unwanted clogging. And is oh, red point here, and is deep enough the first pass. Honestly, I think that this razor is the cold water now. Is the perfect razor to go against the grain every day. One single pass, and you'll be happy and you'll feel smooth and yeah satisfied with your shape uh honestly it's, it's a nice machine uh one day we'll fix the little problem that i that i is just you know bending this a little bit or changing the angle of of uh that but yeah it's once once they do that will be almost a perfect razor uh no complaint no complaint at all oh actually no complaint at all the way it is already i've been using it three times and i'm liking it every time more so and you know i am surprised about how deep it goes, and you can see it from the red point, but yeah, how deep it goes, uh, even though it's so gentle. Then one, one year, once you're done, just undo this screw. Here we go. And the blade stay here. See? Nice. So, I guess I'm done for the shave of the day. The, the razor is cool, it's actually really satisfying, it's a piece of art, it is. And that's it. And, well, if you like the video, uh, subscribe to the channel to not lose further video and thumbs up. If you want to support the channel, uh, there are a few ways, like buying the channel merchandise or uh, subscribe for uh, early access to the videos. Well, thank you everyone for watching me till this point and I hope you like the shave and I'll see you another day. Bye-bye.